Good morning. Today I thought it'd be fun to show you guys what a full day of my life looks like when I don't have my little ones. These pants look good. Sure. I'd be lying if I said I had a routine or schedule. Truthfully, every day is so different, but I do base my day around things I have to get done. That being said, my quick and easy morning routine is the same every single day. First, I put clothes on, then I brush my teeth. After that, I put on some deodorant. I don't like to, but if I have to, I can go a day or two without showering. What I can't do is go a day or two without brushing my teeth or putting on deodorant. I feel disgusting if I do that. So like I said, no schedule, but here are the things I like to base my days around when I don't have my kids. Today we're gonna start off by getting some work done. I typically like to get work done at night, especially because when I have the kids, it's the only time I can really focus in without distractions. But because I've been falling behind on my upload schedule, I really have to get this done first. I used to upload at 8 every morning. Currently, it's 11.30, and I haven't even started this video. Oh! So my work pro process was interrupted, and I'm not even mad about it. Look what came in the mail! Get laid beds? Oh! Something is definitely getting laid on these. And it's a mattress, because these are my bed frames. <laughs> but do you know what's gonna get laid on top of the mattress? Some duvet covers and bed sheets. <laughs> I really need to hurry up and get this work done, or else I'm not gonna have time for anything else on my to-do list. Whew. Done with the essential work for now. I still have a little bit more to catch up on later, but at least now I can breathe a little bit. Oh, this is around the time I usually take to get some chores done, maybe go run some errands, or complete any random tasks that I want to get done. And today, I want to set up my bed frame. Oh, I've been waiting for this thing for so long, I can't wait. I have been loving setting up my apartment, but it takes up so much time that I'm really excited for it to be done. That way I'll have more time to work on the rest of my goals for 2023. It will also allow me to spend more quality time with my little ones on their weeks, which truthfully, I can never get enough of. Let's get started though. Oh, 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 oh my god! It's the perfect color. Look at this. Ah! <laughs> I'm in love. It looks good. I actually wasn't going to show you guys what it looked like so I could reveal it in like a fully furnished bedroom tour, but I thought to myself, that's kind of lame. And plus, I'm going to be getting so many pieces for these walls that it's still going to look crazy different anyways. So here it is. The way it matches with those shelves. I'm living. I wouldn't normally keep this in the vlog, but since this is a day in my life and I want to give you guys a little bit of behind the scenes, I thought I'd share with you guys that part of the work I have to get done throughout the day is filming sponsors. No, this video isn't sponsored, but I do have to film one for this mattress. I really like my sponsors to be fast-paced with a whole bunch of B-roll to make them more entertaining. But to do that, I gotta take a whole bunch of videos of the product that I'm promoting, which can take me anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour. This is just an example of what I look like when I take product shots. Ooh, look at that shot. <laughs> as ridiculous and stupid as that looked, I really do get a lot of cool shots that way. Anywho. Oh, it's looking good, huh? It's coming together nicely. I love this. <laughs> I went with a low bed to make this space feel bigger. I feel like a big bed frame, especially for a queen size, would just take up all the room. So with this, it gives more space and a more minimalist look. Yeah, I like I, it. I love that. Looks good. Thank you, Luvan. Thank yeah. you, thank you. Take out the trash. I think it's finally time though for my favorite parts of my routine. Hey guys, I forgot my climbing shoes. I tried out the rentals, but they have no grip. And I know that sounds bougie and dumb, but seriously, it affects your rock climbing so much. It's frustrating. So instead of climbing, we're gonna do an upper body workout that will help us with our climbing. Buddy 
Croix. I found a fan ears. <laughs> What's up? It was nice meeting you. <laughs> Have a good one. One thing I do get to do now that I don't have the kids all the time is I get to work more on my social life, which is nice, but if you really think about it, it comes at the expense of hanging out with my kids, so that kind of sucks. What's up, guys? <laughs> Yes, daddy? Bro, I'm single. <laughs> Be know. careful with all that. Well, you are daddy. <laughs> oh my god. Anyways, peace out, guys. Enjoy Bye. your time in Idaho. I'm, I'm having FOMO. I know. <laughs> you the hoe. <laughs> Anyways, peace out, guys. I'll Bye. see you when you get back. Some friends from California were visiting. They stopped by here. They're going to drive to Idaho. I'm so jealous. I know. <laughs> I got the kids this week, or else we would have been there. Yeah. It's okay, though. Kids over everything. That was awesome. And you know, on the way here, I thought to myself, I do these things every single day, but to be pointing out how and why I structure my days the way I do, it kind of pulls back the curtain and shows you the foundations and the things I have to work around for every single one of these videos. Does that make sense? Like, I feel like it's showing you all the workarounds that I usually don't record in film, while also showing you why I emphasize certain things in these videos. All the random tasks, activities, and social life things I do, those are usually the foundations to every video. Like, no joke. I feel like every segment in these videos is a random task, a social life moment, and or a workout moment. The workarounds are getting the editing done and the real estate done. Thought that was interesting. Random thought, thought I would share. Like, like yesterday's video, the random task was having to go fix the ticket, my social life was hanging out with Kyla, and we worked out in it. <laughs> That's literally all these videos are based off of, at least the majority of them, while I'm out with the kids. Unfortunately, there is one thing in my routine that I actually won't get to work on today, and that is real estate school. I'm behind on work, and I really want to catch up before the kids get here, because then it will be very, very hard to keep up with it. So that'll have to be set aside for another time. For now, let's focus up and get caught up. Got the majority of my editing done. This video is pretty much ready to go. All I need to do now is take a thumbnail. Taking a thumbnail usually takes me only about 10 minutes. It's editing that thumbnail that can take me anywhere from 30 minutes to 45 minutes. So, an hour all together. 5.44 in the AM. <clears throat> and truthfully, I don't know how this happened. Today was supposed to be like a regular, normal, every day in the life without my children, and it turned into a grind of a work day. Not every day is like this, although I have had a few days like this during these last 41 days of daily vlogging, but it's been so fun and so worth it. You guys literally got to see me do everything today except for going to the bathroom. Yes, I only eat one meal a day right now because I'm intermittent fasting. It's helping with my productivity, helping me save time. And I don't recommend it, don't think it's for everyone, but it's definitely been working for me. Anywho, before I go to bed, I gotta shower, brush my teeth, clean out my ears, put some face lotion, deodorant, and then hit the hay. That's pretty much it for today's vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace!